M0 FXB, welcome back to my videos on the G106. If you go to the link I provide in the description, click G106, then you'll get the window to download the firmware. It will put it in your download folder. And let's have a look at the changes. Number one, to work with JTDX WSJTX, uh, C Zygu Radio CRV reference. They've added two documents in this download that you can just see here. If we go to the update tool is called TerraTerm. I've used that before. The firmware, if you click, double click, there's two documents. Let's click one. And you've got the all this CIV information here. Which, yeah, very techy. Uh, let me know how this will help you, because I don't know. Um, but yeah, CIV information. But if you click the other one, the where is it not that one this one here it gives you all the settings for wsjtx and that definitely will help because we're going to be giving this a go scrolling down and it's got some good settings there you set it at icon 705 move me out of the way icon 705 board rate 19200 data default da -da -da. so it's all there all the settings that's all they give you but hopefully that's going to help us with that when we eventually do that but right now i'm on version 1.01 .01. if you look here and we press the big vfo turn till you get to number four the little menu numbers here four stroke five version i'm on 1.0 so the newer version is 1.3 let's just look at that double click firmware and there it is there 1.3 so i'm definitely going to load that in you are going to need a cable that looks like this i'll put a link in the description it's the same one for the g90 the 5105 a few other models and by the way cinetel and radiology are doing a promotion on this radio at the moment they've reduced it by about a third so when you use the cable, one end is going to have to go in this COM connector here. And one of the good things, they now when you turn the volume to zero, it does go to zero. So this isn't the firmware install video. It's just gathering information, letting you know what you need, cables you need, software, ETC. And then we're going to make a completely separate video doing it. Bye for now.